ASP.NET Storefront Commander is a Windows-based utility that allows you to connect to your ASP.NET Storefront's web service interface so that you can update products, categories, and also manage day-to-day -day tasks such as downloading orders. This utility works by parsing CSV and Excel files and then converting those CSV files into native XML commands that the web services interface understands. Many customers aren't familiar with the XML structure and prefer a known format such as CSV files or Excel which they can work with using Microsoft Office or OpenOffice. We've designed this utility to give you most of the power of the web service interface without having to learn or hire a programmer to create an XML feed for you to update your products and your category information. Commander includes various ways to insert, update, and modify your existing data. Starting with version R2, we've introduced support for multi-store as well as multi-language. We've improved the GUI interface, made it so the system doesn't seem like it's crashed when it's working, and also made sure that it works properly on different versions of the Windows operating system. As of April 1st, 2011 with version R2, ASP.NET Storefront Commander works properly with Windows XP 32-bit, 64-bit, Windows 2003 and 2008 server, both 32-bit and 64-bit editions, as well as Windows Vista and Windows 7, both 32-bit and 64-bit editions. Please note, before installing Commander, you have to make sure that you are administrator and have full write access to the directories that Commander will be working with. ASP.NET Storefront Commander includes various tabs for importing, exporting, as well as running SQL exports for custom queries that you may have. We've created the GUI so that it's easy to understand what information you'll need to perform certain tasks, such as choosing different actions will inform you the minimum number of fields required to perform the action you're looking for, one of the typical requests most customers have is inserting products and variant information. We made that very easy for you to simply select the fields that you like to uh, insert into your ASP.NET Storefront website, and the commander will create a sample CSV file so that you can populate that CSV file with the information that you'll need. With exports, we made it also very easy for you to perform uh, criteria export based on the things that you're looking for. You can simply select the fields that you want to export specify product ID ranges or the dates from when you had uh, entered uh, the product into the system. If you're using multi-store, you can also choose if you only want to export items mapped to a certain uh, store. Uh, the same thing is available for different locales. If you happen to have different locales, with Commander we've made it very easy. You can, you'll now have a separate file for each language. And if you ever want to upload that information again, you simply specify the language. You do not need to format your products and your category information with an ML tag for each item. With R2, we made it very easy. Simply use a locale, and you can have separate files for your English, Spanish, French, whatever other language you might be using as well. In order to make kit export easy, we've actually have a separate tab for you to specify criteria for exporting kit items. This allows you to keep separate CSV files for items within a kit product versus your regular items. We've done this because we find majority of the customers do not use kit items, and if they do, they usually represent a fraction of their total items. So instead of having to make a complicated structure where you'll have various rows for every product, we've entered the kit system where you can now have your kit products separately, edit kit items, and upload it, and then you can have your main products in a separate CSV file. This allows customers to manage both items quickly and efficiently, and make sure that all your products are in the proper areas so that you don't get your kit and your regular products mixed up. We've also added the ability for you to export your orders and customer information. This system will essentially give you a raw dump of your customer and your product table. What this allows you to do is if you need a raw dump of your information and then you need to refine it later for any sort of integration it will allow you to quickly download information based on the IDs or the ranges that you'd like to specify. Another innovative feature that the commander has is that we've actually integrated the feed system into the commander itself so you don't need to rely on the ASP.NET Storefront's built-in feed export system. Our feed system works a little differently from the stock system because it does not rely on XML packages. 
Instead, we've built the logic within the commander itself. What commander will do is log onto your database, grab all the products that you're looking for, and then export those products into the feed that you would like to have. We'll be offering more feed systems as we go. Currently, we do offer Google Feed, but expect new feeds for Shopping.com, Shopzilla, and other popular pricing engines as time goes by. One of the things that you can do in our feed system is specify a file split after every after so many records. Depending on the search engine you're, or the pricing engine you're using, this may be required. Some pricing engines have a 5,000 record limit per file, so in that case, this will be useful. For exports that are not covered in our commander, we do offer a SQL export system. This system will essentially export the CSV result of any query that you're wanting to run. This is useful for running custom queries, for example, such as if you needed to run a query for customers uh, that have made a purchase in the last six months. In that case, a query can be created, saved, and that query can then be run to retrieve the result in an easy-to-read CSV file format. The Scheduler tab is one of the most advanced tabs in our ASP.NET Storefront Commander software. What the Scheduler tab lets you do is schedule routine tasks that you may want to run on your website repeatedly. For example, if you have an integration with a point of sale system that's exporting a CSV file every couple of hours, you can actually set Commander to look for that file and process that file every couple of hours. Another thing that you could do is let's say you needed to have an export for your uh, pricing and as well as your category information done routinely. You can schedule an export to happen routinely and this will at the in interval that you specify will export a CSV file that you can use to view your product information. Similarly you can also schedule feed exports as well as any custom query you've created in SQL. Um, a good example of how the feed system would work is let's say you needed to upload your feed to Google every 12 hours. Well, using Commander, you can schedule that to run every 12 hours, and it, that task will run repeatedly uh, until you actually tell Commander to stop. Using the schedule, you can do these routine tasks very easily without having any, a human being monitoring this system constantly. The Commander generates logs for any operation that it does, and also makes a copy of any CSV file that you tell it to uh, process. So you'll have a log system to go back and review later to make sure everything was done properly. To make performing all these tasks in Commander easy for you, we include video tutorials in each tab for you to view. These tutorials are available on YouTube, on our YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash similar technologies, or you can scroll down to any tab in ASP.NET Storefront Commander and view, and view a video on how to perform these tasks. We'll be updating these videos with newer versions as new features are added, but to get you a good start, we recommend viewing these videos uh, to get a good idea of what operations are available in Commander. Thank you for viewing our ASP.NET Storefront Commander introduction video. We hope using Commander will make managing a website easier and more efficient. Be sure to check our website for later versions of Commander as time goes by. And if you have any questions on the use of Commander or how we could help your business, please feel free to contact us by going to simran.com forward slash contact us and contact us in our general office or any one of our sales consultants for more information.